All right, I'm here today with Judge Peel, Chairman of the Watermelon Festival. Judge, can you tell me a little bit about the festival? Well, this year will be our 59th year celebrating Panhandle Watermelon Festival in Chipley. Uh, we're extremely excited this year. Uh, it's this weekend, Friday and Saturday night, and we'll start uh, Friday night at Powell's Park here in Chipley. Uh, we'll start at 5 o'clock. Gates will open. There'll be all kind of activities for kids, kids' games, uh, slides, bounce houses, all kind of uh, things for, for the family to do. Uh, and then at 6 o'clock, we'll start with our music. We have this year excited to have Daryl Singletary open the show for us at 6, and he'll be followed by the group Exile, and that'll be followed by our headliner, Mark Wills. And all that'll be Friday night again at Powell's Park. Uh, the good news is everything is absolutely free. And so uh, just come and uh, bring your lawn chairs. Uh, you might want to bring an umbrella to either... Uh, to keep the rain off of you if it rains or to keep the sun off of you if it, if it doesn't. So uh, just uh, invite anybody and everybody that wants to come down. All that's Friday night and then Saturday we'll have our big uh, day which will start uh, Saturday morning at the Panhandle Shrine Club with our pancake breakfast. Our 5,000 meter run will start at the Florida Panhandle Technical College uh, here in Chipley. We'll have an antique car show that will go on all day long. Uh, we'll have a big parade at 10 o'clock. There's no cost to be in the parade. Lineup starts at 9 o'clock at the Chipley High School football field. Everybody's welcome to come and ride in the parade if they want to do so. And then after the parade, we'll move over to the uh, Ag Center on Highway 90 in Chipley. And we'll have music there by the Thompsons. Uh, of course, have arts and crafts, those type of things. The Thompsons will start at 11 o'clock. And then at noon, we'll have our big watermelon auction. And that's where we sell watermelons to raise money for this festival. Those of you that may not be familiar with the watermelon auction, year before last we had a watermelon that sold for $10,000. So uh, we made some national news with that, and something that was, was unique, something we were proud of. And of course that money goes to pay for this festival because, as I indicated before, uh, everything's free. So that's how we raise money to pay for the festival. And then after the watermelon auction at 1.30 on Saturday there at the Ag Center, Jimmy Fortune. Jimmy Fortune was a member of the Statler Brothers. He's in the Country Music Hall of Fame and we're extremely excited to have him come and perform. Again, that'll be at no cost. Uh, and so we're looking forward to that on Saturday afternoon as well. I keep emphasizing the fact that everything is free and that's because it is, other than any arts and crafts that you might want to buy or any food items that you may want to purchase. Uh, admission to everything is absolutely free. Our community is just tremendous. They step up every year and uh, just, just give to, to this, this festival. They've really wrapped their arms around it and embraced it. And we're extremely excited to, to have uh, so many good presenting sponsors, so many festival partners, so many sponsors who make this event happen every year. And we're really looking forward to it. The other thing that's happening on Saturday, it's a little bit unique this year, we're giving away a pink Cadillac. Uh, Ray Hall Miller Chevrolet over in Mariana has donated a pink Cadillac. Uh, you can buy $2 raffle tickets for a chance to win that pink Cadillac. All of the proceeds, 100% of them, goes to Pink Cares. It doesn't go to the Watermelon Festival. It goes to Pink Cares. That's an organization uh, that helps uh, women and children who are fighting cancer. And so we're proud to be a part of that, join in with that, and we'll be drawing for that pink Cadillac sometime around 1.30 probably on Saturday afternoon. But we just uh, are looking forward to this weekend, looking forward to Friday night again. Come out to Powell's Park, bring your lawn chairs, you'll see uh, good quality entertainment. This is a family focused event, no alcohol, no tobacco. Uh, and we just want to invite everybody to come to Chipley, be here Friday night, and then join us again on Saturday for this year's Panhandle Watermelon Festival. And look forward to having you.